So why weren't the combined data? Why weren't set operators, joins, and subqueries? Well, let me give you a couple of reasons. First, by learning to combine data, you'll get query results you otherwise couldn't, plain and simple. You'll no longer be limited to using canned reports and views, nor will you have to limit yourself to data contained in one table. Plus, you'll master this skill and you can gain confidence writing queries. Learning how to do joins and subqueries can be frustrating. Once you learn them, not only will you pass one of the greatest stumbling blocks in SQL, but you will also have made your job easier by reducing the frustration. It's a win-win if you ask me. There's nothing worse than being given an assignment to pull data using SQL, knowing you need to combine or um, join data from different tables without fully understanding what you're doing or how it works. You hobble together a query based on examples found on the internet, but it's difficult to know how it all works. Your confidence diminishes and you run out of time to complete the assignment. Finally, you admit it's as good as it gets and you deliver the results. Tragically, the wrong results. See, you used the wrong type of match and accidentally dropped rows from the final result. Or maybe you've written one of those queries that runs forever. You hate having to change it since it always takes so long to see results. And when you do run it, the server is crushed to its knees. You think there's a better way to do the query, that there's something wrong, and it's nagging you. Without direction, you continue with the query as is, and unfortunately continue to match every combination of parts or customers. Of course, all this is hidden from the final result, because in desperation, you use a distinct clause to eliminate duplicate records. The query takes 45 minutes to run. SQL can be mysterious. For some of you, you're just getting started find SQL exciting, but there's so many choices you just don't know where to start. Well, let me introduce myself. I'm Chris Wenzel and I'm here to introduce you to SQL 201, my online course for SQL that will help you learn to combine data using set operators, joins, and subqueries. In this course I'm going to show you in a practical, easy to understand English where to start, why SQL is written the way it is, and what are the common mistakes and pitfalls to avoid. I'll only teach you what's relevant. I won't teach you useless commands or crud. Whether you're just starting to learn SQL or want to take your skill to the next level, SQL 201 and I can help you understand how to query multiple tables and combine them into single results. Once you've completed this course, you'll have thorough knowledge of why databases are structured the way they are, what normalization is, and how to combine data using three major techniques. In the course, you'll explore set operators, such as union, intersect, and accept. We'll look at main types of joins, including inner, outer, self, and cross joins. And finally, you'll learn where, to, where and when to use subqueries. We'll see how to use subqueries and select from, where, and having clauses. Once you've completed the course, you'll have the knowledge to know which of these three techniques to use and the confidence to know you chose the correct method. I first learned about SQL in 1985, and I've been in love with the language ever since. You see, I'm really passionate about SQL. Let me help you get started in an easy-to-follow, step-by-step manner. Use your time wisely so you focus on what's important to learn, and I'll answer your questions, really. I've been working with databases for the past 25 years. In fact, I've worked as a developer, an analyst, and a DBA during those times. I've gotten to really know how to use databases as well as empathize with those that don't. I'll show you what's important to learn so you can get started quickly. Whether you're an IT professional or someone in business that wants to harness the power of SQL to rocket their job, I can help. When you enroll in SQL 201, you'll be able to learn anytime, anywhere. Since the course is online, you can learn it at your own pace. Replay lessons that you wish and even view and listen to them on your mobile phone. You can download the video lessons and listen to them offline. I actually recommend taking them with you on your next date to get through those dull moments. Okay, kidding aside, download the videos and replay them anytime you wish, even with the love of your life. So the course has many ways you can get feedback on your progress. Each module has an optional quiz. The quizzes are automatically graded so you know your score. Also, I can go into detail on each answer so you can understand why an answer is so. All the examples and problems are based on Microsoft SQL Server and the VentureWorks databases. You can choose to follow along with your own free copy. If you haven't done so already, I'll get you hooked up with the database using my quick start guide. By working the examples and advanced problems, you not only reinforce what you've learned, 
but I'll provide detailed explanations of the answers to help you understand the reasoning behind the approach. I've also included some bonus material to help you write better SQL. Once you've completed the course, you'll know a sound approach to decomposing a problem, writing proper SQL using join, subqueries, and also have an appreciation for database normalization. Once you're done, you won't have to rely on others to write, write queries or retrieve their data. Rely on them to get your information. Be frustrated and confused about what data to combine and how. Be confused over whether to use a join or a subquery or worry where to start. Check out what others have said about the course and my approach to using SQL. Some have said, thanks Chris for the job well done. I've read several blogs and tech journals and none has been this clear and simplified. Thanks again. And others said, I stumbled upon your website. I need to explain the, in quotes, normal forms to somebody. And while I've been a DBA for 16 years and clearly I know the rules of normalization, I'd never had to discuss them out loud, not since a training class in the late 90s anyway. I was finding myself at a loss for words trying to explain it. A couple of Google search later and I stumbled upon your site, specifically your database normalization pages. And I wanted to tell you how impressed I was at your description. I'm going to refer people from here from now on. Thanks for putting in that effort. Wow, again, so wonderful tutorial. It is so clear and understandable before I've read lots of articles about joins, but this was completely distinct. Thank you, sir, for this part. And finally, the last one I'd like to share is someone said, thanks a lot, at Chris Wenzel. I think you're the best on the internet to teach normalization this simple. The site also is structured in a good manner, wishes. So you can see many folks have appreciated what I've done for them to teach them SQL, and I, th I think you will also benefit from it. So today I'm offering SQL 201 to you for $129. For the $129, you're going to get over 40 online videos in four modules covering the important aspects of set operations, joins, and subqueries. This offer includes the SQL 201 online video course, quizzes, videos detailing answers to the quizzes, sample problems, and answers within select written guides. I'm also available to help you via email to clarify concepts and answer your questions about the course. The class size is limited. As I want to provide you with the best support possible, I'm limiting the class size. Enrollment will end next Tuesday or sooner if class limit is exceeded. So here's my 100% no questions asked take it to the bank guarantee. I personally guarantee that if you make a diligent effort to use a few of the techniques in this course, you'll be able to combine data from multiple tables in a single result. That's right, I'll guarantee you'll learn this new SQL skill. If you don't, I'll refund the entire cost of the course to you. Actually, you get double protection. Here's how. At any time during the 12 months, if you sincerely feel I fell short in any way on delivering anything I promise, I'll be happy to give you a complete refund, even if it's on the last day of the 12 month. So reserve your place today in our course. Click on the Send button below and enroll in SQL 201. Remember, space is limited. Once this course fills, Enrollment closes. The last day to enroll is next Tuesday. Once the course is closed, I can't take any more students until the next session. You don't want to miss out on this opportunity to enhance your SQL skills and take your career to the next level. Don't be caught with no training or the added bonuses SQL offers you. Once enrollment closes, many of the course extras, such as email support, problem sets, and detailed answers to quizzes won't be available to future classes nor at this price. Remember, this course covers the key ways to combine data. I personally guarantee that if you follow the lessons in this class, you will learn and understand the major ways to combine data, such as using join, subqueries, and set operators. I will personally answer your questions via email to ensure your success. You have me as your support staff. I will help you. This is a limited offer, so please enroll today and reserve your place in my SQL 201 class.